The railroad helped build America and a small piece of its history is being saved in Wazetta. Joe Mazin shows you in this week's So Minnesota. In downtown Wyzetta, you'll find champagne wishes and caviar dreams. Here, you can see magnificent mansions, luxurious cars, and this less than beautiful. They boarded it up. Boarded up building. What the heck is that and why is it still here? The house seems to be on the wrong side of the tracks. It doesn't quite fit Wyzetta. When many would see an eyesore, it has seen better days. Judy Starkey with the Wyzetta Heritage Preservation Board sees history. Wyzetta really turned into an important place when they built the railroad. <laughs> Judy knows the story behind the section foreman house. This is not a very inviting front door. <laughs> with railroad tracks out its front door and Lake Minnetonka out its back. This was a plum assignment because it was on the lake. A lot of these section foreman house were out in the boonies. The house was built in 1902 by the Great Northern Railroad for foremen and their families. The foreman's job was to keep 20 miles of track in good working order. All section foreman homes were built from the same plan. And so everything would just come out on the train and you just put it up. The ladies who were the wives of section foremen would say, it's fine because if my curtains fit here, they're going to fit there. Over the years, nearly all the section foreman homes were torn down, except for this one. This is, I think, the last one. It might be the last one in the whole country for it by now, I don't know. The railroad sold the home in the 1960s. The city of Wyzetta has owned it for more than three decades. Over time, the house became run down. Well, the city really wasn't that interested in it. So the Wyzetta Heritage Preservation Board and Historical Society started a campaign for the city to save the home. Judy even built this model of the house and had it placed in Wyzetta City Hall to show council members of its potential. Oh, yeah, we've got something down here. They began to realize that there was some sort of a gem here. I don't know, it doesn't look like much like a gem right now, but that it could be used. Recently, the home was placed on the National Register of Historic Places. The plan is to renovate the house and use it as an interactive learning center. Saving this home from the wrecking ball wasn't easy, but Judy says keeping our history alive is well worth it. I'm delighted. I, I really am. I, I'm just, we're just very, very pleased. And we know that now something will be done with it. In this town, you can find the best things money can buy just a sad looking place and it's going to look very nice and a house with a history that's priceless in Wyzetta, joe mason five eyewitness news and a pricey view to go with it joe shares a different minnesota story every monday night so if you've got an idea about maybe where he should go next email us at nightcast at kstp.com